Hey guys, in this video, I will show you how you can add Hostinger business email to Outlook. It's quite easy. So without further ado, let's get started. First of all, log into your Hostinger account. Then you need to go to emails and then you need to set up your business email if you don't have one. So I will leave the video in the description below uh, showing you step by step how you can create your biz first business email. Super easy and fast. So if you don't have it, then watch the video and come back uh, here later. And once you have the business email, then you need to go to press and manage. Then you need to go and press on uh, connect apps and devices and you should get uh, a IMAP, CMTP and POP, right? And then what you need to do here is you need to go to Outlook. Then on Outlook, uh, gear icon will be on the top uh, right here. You need to press on that, then press add account. And then you need to put your business, hosting your business email here. So for me is Tom at uh, Mr. Top Advice Online Advice Online dot shop, right? And then press continue. And then uh, select show more. And here you need to add your business email password so that you configured when you uh, create your business email. For me, is this one. And then uh, here uh, you need to basically check a few things. So IMAP incoming server, uh, it need to be matched. Uh, it needs to be matched with this one, imap.hostinger.com and the port is uh, 993. So we need to look again, uh, imap.hostinger.com 993. And then CMTP configuration here uh, should be uh, here as well. Uh, cmtp.hostinger.com uh, and port is four, uh, 465. Uh, it's the same. And then, uh, and that's pretty much it here about the settings. Then press continue, press continue here. Then we need to wait for a couple of seconds. And now as you can see here, my uh, uh, mail is synced. Then you can go uh, here and make it primary if you want to. And once you do that, then <clears throat> uh, we can see that is uh, setting up. And in the meantime, I can uh, simply go to my web my, uh, uh, emails, business email here, and then log into the uh, account to show you that this is working. So uh, just press next, no optional data, continue. And we need to wait for a couple of seconds here and it should work. So you can now uh, compose emails with your business email. If I put new email, as you can see here, it's my business email. And then I can send message to, for example, me. Mind that shop. And let's put hey and hey and send email. And usually it take a few seconds longer to appear on the Outlook, but on uh, uh, webmail, it should appear in almost instantly. So as you can see here, uh, the message went through and also on Outlook, it should appear after, I don't know, maybe half a minute or something like that. Yeah, as you can see here, uh, it just appear. Right. And that's pretty much it. What you need to do here if you want to connect uh, Ostinger business email to Outlook. So if I help you out, please press like button and subscribe for more. Take care. Bye.